the Earth is home to many animals and plants that have gone extinct. Sometimes, though, a supposedly extinct animal may still be alive. They have even been given the name the Lazarus creatures. These previously extinct animals, who were rediscovered, are crucial to our environment. There are even prehistoric animals that could still exist. If one of these extinct species is found roaming the Earth, they may still be hope for its population. So let's travel the globe together in search of living species that were once thought to be extinct. Y para un poco más de diversión, busca nuestra mascota Niso durante todo el video. Tiniest Wolf Through human history, disasters and illness can do terrible things to populations. Does the Black Plague sound familiar to you? Well, diseases don't only affect humans. Japan, the Honshu wolf was one of the smallest wolves recorded. About the size of a cocker spaniel, it was said to be extinct after a series of rabies outbreaks wiped out the population. However, villages have spotted their animal near streams in the Japanese highlands. So maybe rabies didn't wipe them out after all. New Caledonia Crested Gecko Misplacing something. You tore the whole house apart looking for it. Animals can sometimes be like our misplaced items. Near Australia, in the island of New Caledonia, a gecko was thought to be extinct. About the length of a pencil, in 1994, the species was rediscovered in the jungles. The geckos are now flourishing with a lifespan as long as 20 years. It makes me wonder how many other lost critters we will find soon. Laotian Rock Rat Shopping for food is part of our weekly routine. It's pretty predictable. Well, we see fruits, vegetables, cheeses, and meats. So you probably wouldn't expect to see an extinct rat while you're shopping for dinner. Looking like a squirrel more than a rat, the Laotian Rock Rat has been found being sold several times in meat markets in Laos. Limestone and other rocks are home to these animals, and scientists have hope that they're more than once believed. It seems that sometimes our weekly shopping trips can be quite surprising. Takahi When you first think of birds, you probably think of an animal flying in the trees. Unless you think of an ostrich. Flying is what we typically think when we define a bird. But not all birds can fly. In fact, one flightless bird has luckily been discovered. Looking more like a chicken with a thick beak, the Takahi was rediscovered 50 years after its reported extinction. It was found while scientists were trying to prove it didn't exist. Native to New Zealand, the flightless bird now lives in captivity to protect their species. Terror Skink Museums where history comes to life with artifacts and extinct cultures. But can museums be more than that? Some are even making history. Explorers for the Natural History Museum in France discover a long-gone lizard thriving in the Isle of Pines near Australia. About the length of a forearm, terror skinks were thought to be extinct for over a hundred years before one was rediscovered in 2003. They filmed the lizard and took its measurements before releasing it back into the wild. The New Holland Mouse Only found in Australia and a similar cousin in Tasmania, a lost species of mouse was found in a national park while on a hike near Sydney. Eating only fungus and seeds, the New Holland Mouse was rediscovered by hikers in 1967. Unfortunately, due to wildfires and deforestation, the mouse population that was trying to strive is now experiencing a significant decline and it should be even more in the next decade. Omura Whale Have you ever been on a boat out at sea and wonder what is living in the waters below? Shark, dolphins, or jellyfish are common responses. What about an extinct whale? Off the coast of Madagascar, Balaenoptera omurai was discovered and named in 2003. Unfortunately, no live specimens were seen. Resembling a small, thin whale, 
the length of a telephone pole, everyone thought it was gone forever. Until a live whale was found 10 years later in the Madagascar waters. This was the first ever living specimen recorded of its kind. This whale is the second largest animal on Earth after the blue whale. Yet, it was discovered not long ago. It really makes me wonder what else is lurking below. Mouth Diablo Buckweed We all heard of a story about a person who accidentally buys the wrong lottery ticket only to win the whole jackpot. Life is full of these happy accidents. Some accidents help with scientific discoveries. Only found in Mount Diablo, California, Mount Diablo buckwheat is a small plant with pink flowers that was considered extinct until a researcher accidentally found one. Since then, the seeds have been collected so the plant won't go extinct anytime soon. Maybe the researcher should have played the lottery too with that kind of luck. Japanese River Otter Pollution is devastating to the world. We all need to do our own part to help minimize pollution or the pollution could end up damaging our entire planet. Pollution almost drove the cute Japanese otter to extinction. The Japanese river otter began declining rapidly until it was thought to have been completely extinct in 2012 due to hunting and pollution. However, people have claimed to have seen the otter more than a dozen different times. Mexican Grizzly Bear Hunting for food or sport, we each have our own opinion. Some cultures celebrate with ceremonies while others throw parades. Chihuahua, Mexico The last confirmed Mexican Grizzly Bear was carried through the streets in a parade in the 1960s. But was that the grizzly end of the bear? In remote areas, scientists started finding claw marks and footprints of the bear. Thankfully, that prey may not have really been the last of the Mexican grizzly bear. Now, we do have something to celebrate. Thylacine Enjoying nature, you will definitely see some plants and small animals. If you're lucky, you may even get the opportunity to lay your eyes on a Lazarus animal. Tasmania is home of the Tasmanian Devil, the largest marsupial in the world, until now. Dog-headed pouch one is the meaning in Greek of the thylacine, who is about the size of a Labrador and is also called the Tasmanian tiger. It was thought to have been extinct because of hunting. Sightings of the striped marsupial began to surface starting in 2016 by hikers and other civilians just passing through the Australian and Tasmanian wilderness. You just never know what you will see when you decide to venture out into nature. Mammoth Museums host extinct animals in their collections. Skeletons of dinosaurs and mammoths are fairly common to see, but are still quite the spectacle. One museum has an actual baby mammoth body for display. Discovered in a frozen mud in Siberia, Liuba, the baby mammoth, is unique. She has all her organs intact. Her body continues to be preserved in a temperature control enclosure at a Russian museum. You and the rest of the world can get an up-close view of a preserved mammoth. She is being studied and her DNA examined for further research and perhaps cloning. The Monster of the Congo River Dinosaurs are extinct. Well, that's mostly true. The Congo River, Africa. It turns out there may be a dinosaur still out there. A long neck and long tail reptile, the Mokelembembe, meaning the one who stops the flow of rivers, is an ancient dinosaur-like animal said to live in the riverbed of the Congo River. Local tribes swear to its existence, but yet none have been confirmed. Some have claimed to find footprints and other markings of the animal. One day, we might just find out this Mokelembembe is more than just a myth. It's always a tragedy when species face extinction, so it's always great news to hear that some are actually still alive. Now it's our job to help them prosper. Thank you for watching this video, and until next time, 
Recuerda hacer clic en el icono de la campana luego de que te suscribas para poder recibir notificaciones instantáneas en todos nuestros videos nuevos.